about, but um, for the viewers here, I would love to talk about your current research. Like what is a day in the life of, of studying these things, like the equipment used and um, can you shed some light on that? For yeah, um, so we, we have a, a, a few sort of parallel research streams going on. Um, there are a couple of students and a collaborator on the team that are working on uh, growing human dermal cells, okay. you know, as, at least as a model, right? It's, it's not a perfect model for skin, but it, it's a start. Mm -hmm. um, and, you know, trying to look at, you know, how do these dermal cells, you know, react to tattoo inks? How do they react when we start illuminating those inks with light? Um, and the idea there being, you know, are we, you know, if we have red ink, red, you know, red ink present and we start illuminating it, do we see a massive die off in cells or do we see something strange happening there? So trying to kind of understand, okay, are we releasing some sort of hazard, some sort of toxic decomposition product? Um, what's going on there? We've got another sort of stream looking at what's actually happening at, at sort of a molecular level when we start illuminating these things. So, you know, if we hit them with a laser versus if we just sort of hit them with, you know, white light, you know, sort of simulated sunlight, can we actually quantify, you know, if we start with pigment yellow 77, for example, what does that break down into, right? What are the, what are the molecular components there? Um, and again, try to understand, you know, maybe the pigment that we're starting with is, you know, there aren't any concerns, but by the time it undergoes some photochemistry, some, some changes with light, you know, it may be releasing something that's a known hazard. So can we understand what's going on there? We've got another direction working with a, a great collaborator um, in Texas, trying to actually understand how laser tattoo removal works. So, you know, it, it may surprise you and your audience, you know, laser tattoo removal is something like an $11 billion a year industry. And the science under, underpinning it is purely speculative, right? When you follow the chain of research back, <clears throat> you find out that the whole industry is based on a paper that has nothing to do with tattoos. It has nothing to do with the materials that are in tattoos. It's a completely different system. And so we, we believe that, that what's actually happening when you're zapping these things with a laser is, you know, at best a matter of speculation. And so our collaborators have techniques to actually sort of watch the laser hit the tattoo ink and then see what happens. Does it fragment in real time or, you know, is something else happening that's, you know, killing off the cells around it? What, what's going on? And then the last um, sort of area we work on is just trying to understand what's in commercial tattoo inks. So for example, um, I don't remember the specific supplier, but you know, we, we purchased something like 20 or 30 inks from, from a company uh, and we looked at their safety data.